Kristen, aren't you tired of your backside looking like a deflated pancake? Are you ever going to get a BBL? <sighs> Today, I'm going to be pretending to do a Q&A with my fiance. But guys, here's the twist. It's going to be a disrespectful Q&A. So guys, I have my notes all right, in my phone here. And I'm going to be pretending to ask Kristen questions that you guys ask. Now, I'm going to be coming up with these questions from the top of my head. And we're going to be seeing her reaction today. It's going to be so lit. So stay tuned. Let's get it. Let's go. What's up, k and squad? It's your boy, Bud Munry. Hey, girl, Kristen. And today, today, I finally have Kristen here with us to answer these questions. You guys been pounding me on my Snapchat, <laughs> sending me DMs saying, hey, I want to ask Kristen these questions. And I'm here, let's do it. Bro, you are popular. That's the first thing I'm gonna say. <laughs> Kristen is popular, because I don't know why you guys are only asking me a couple questions, but you're asking her tons of questions. Like, <laughs> you're always like- Are you jealous? <laughs> He's jealous. I, I did. Okay. Okay, so then send me questions and I'll ask him. They still love you, babe. It's just a different type of love, I guess. Okay, so now you're feeling yourself. No, I'm not. Okay. Anyways, I'll answer to the best of my ability. <laughs> hey, let's go. Make sure y'all hit that like button right now, man. Follow us, show some love. Follow Kristen on her Instagram. Follow Kristen on her new YouTube channel. She's dropping bangers over there. Follow me on my Instagram. Follow me everywhere. You get me. Follow us on Snap. You already know the vibes. My YouTube channel will be linked down below in the, in the comments. Let's get it. First question. Okay. Kristen, how do you get to be so beautiful? Aww. <laughs> that is so cute. You guys. <laughs> well, I don't know what to say. This is how God made me. This is how my mama, my dad yeah. just decided to um, mesh their genes together and, and spit me out. But thank you so much for saying that I'm beautiful. You are probably beautiful as well. Okay. okay. <laughs> Oh wow, there's one question here for me. Reef, how do you get your waves to be so nice? Mm. Oh, you know what I'm saying? I constantly brush my hair, y'all see the vibes. And he doesn't let me touch them. I really don't like that she touches my hair <laughs> after a haircut because she'd be like pushing, trying to push it back. Because I don't realize that I'm only supposed to be going forward. Sometimes I forget. Me forget. So now I know to go forward because yes. that's the way that the wave pattern goes, goes. forward, you know, you like an saying? ocean. But the key is to do washing styles. That is like basically you getting a specific, like getting nice soap, mm -hmm. soap that lathers. You put in your hair and you got to brush in the mirror for like half an hour, train your hair to move the direction. And then you can lay your waves down, wash it out and all that good stuff. It's a, it's a process. It's a process. Yeah, but it's worth it though. It's really nice. Yeah. Kristen, aren't you tired of your backside looking like a deflated pancake? Are you ever going to get a BBL? What? That was a loaded one. <laughs> oh shoot. Sorry, they said a deflated pancake. <laughs> what? Oh what's a deflated <laughs> Whoa, that is crazy. That's what it looks like back there? No, no. <laughs> Hold up. Cause the last time I checked it was not deflated and it wasn't a pancake. There's a little something something there. I'm a petite girl, but I've never thought of a DBL. I've always thought if I'm gonna get it bigger back there, if I wanted to, I would just take my ass to the gym. Facts. Um, cause we used to work out like crazy before. And it was nice. And it was like it's still nice now. I was about to say. I don't know. They're tripping. They're tripping. They're tripping. Okay, Kristen, your nails always look so beautiful. What is your I ideal length of nails? Um, well, right now they're not that beautiful. They're like growing out, but thank you so much. I like medium length because it's a nice in-betweener, not too long, so you can still do stuff. Okay. Okay, Kristen, how does it feel to be a featherweight? You weigh about 80 pounds. I'm 115 pounds. 115, yeah. 80 pounds? That's like what for a a five-year-old? <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. When last did you hear of someone weighing 80 pounds? I mean, people weigh 80 pounds all the time. I just never knew any adult to weigh 80 pounds. Right, like a young kid. Well, maybe they're saying like looking from the screen, they mm -hmm. probably feel like you're lightweight. 
but that's that's not something that I would. Say. I mean, I'm 115 pounds. So what does it feel like to be 150 pounds? Um, I feel small. I'm also short. I'm five five, but I like to say I'm five six because yeah. But um, I don't know. It feels normal. It feels regular. <laughs> yeah, this next question is, is is a little weird too. Hey Kristen, what's your breakfast routine look like? I'm trying to lose weight. Are you still eating just one cracker a day to keep the weight away? One cracker? <laughs> one cracker? One cracker for breakfast? That's tripping. Who asked that? What's their name? Um, what is this? Emily625? Well, Emily, I don't just eat a cracker for breakfast, but if you must know what I eat for breakfast, I eat a great meal. Sometimes it comes comprised with an egg, bacon, pancakes, orange juice. Babe likes to have that too. But a cracker? Why do you think I only eat a cracker? Yeah, they're booking. Should we move on? This is what, second question? Third question about my weight? Yes, I'm not paying attention. What's going on right now? <laughs> when I look at myself, I don't feel like I'm that skinny. You're not. I feel like I'm like medium, in between. You're perfect. I'm proud of how I am. You're good. Okay. Princess Kayla asks, Kristen, did you get a boob job? There's no way someone as skinny as you would have those big kaka kaka, cha 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 cha. Help a sister out. I don't know what, what's. Kaka? Cha 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 chas. Oh, cha 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 chas. Like, you know, like cha chas cha chas. I want to shake Um, these are the tits that God gave me. I don't know. That's just how they are. A lot of girls get boob jobs. Some don't. I didn't. Um, I didn't feel like I had to. I didn't want to. I'm too scared when it comes to surgery. But. Yeah, a lot of questions about weight. Okay, Nigel. Kristen, do you miss the days your eyebrows weren't as big and bushy? It's quite caterpillar like. <laughs> That's rude, yo. I mean, you did say that they were. I've always had. Bushy eyelashes? Big. My eyebrows? It was. You think they're bushy? <laughs> no, I'm just saying you said that they were bushy. I mean, they're big. They're not like bushy though. Usually I have them shaped, but they are big. I have a lot of hair. Is it so? Is that why you go and get your eyebrows done because they're bushy? Well, every girl gets their eyebrows done most of the time. If you have a lot of hair, some girls that don't have hair they just draw it in. They just but draw it, in, it helps so with the makeup look and stuff like that. But I wouldn't say that they're bushy. I mean, when I don't get them done, they're kind of grown out, but. I don't know, I feel like that's not the, the way to ask a question, like, mm -hmm. it's kind of rude. I, a lot I'm of just, these questions are rude. I'm just saying they are, they're not like, they're not like super big, guys, it's just sometimes the camera might make, make it look bigger than they actually are. Well, they are like on the bigger end, they're not as skinny, they're kind of wider, mm -hmm. but I like that for my face. Yeah, they fit, they fit Yeah, I feel like face. they fit my they fit face. face for sure. But, I don't know, y'all need to work on the way you ask questions. That's like... Okay. Um, would you ever shave your teeth down? They're quite large and rabbit-like. Buffy the Chomper. Oh. Wow. There's nothing wrong with my teeth. See, my teeth are... They, some people say my teeth are like chiclet teeth. Whereas now they're saying that yours are large and rabbit-like. Aren't rabbit teeth long? But they're kind of buff. Like, you know, you remember Bugs Bunny? <laughs> <laughs> buff? Buff. What does that mean? Well, what does Buffy the Chomper mean? I know, I have no idea what the hell that I'm, means. I think that's I what they're what calling What is Buffy you. the Chomper? I don't know. I've never heard that in my life. I think they're saying that like, your teeth are so buff, like your chompoo, like... Type shit. But she doesn't eat like that, okay. so that's crazy. Are you serious right now? I just said you don't eat like that. <laughs> Why are you making that face? Because I'm thinking of what Buffy the Chomper would be doing. I don't even know who Buffy the Chomper is. But they're saying it's you, so I know who they're saying it is. Okay, this is 
Are you trying to make me like get veneered or something? Whoa! No! I think veneers would make them even bigger, no? Maybe. But I'm proud of the way my teeth are. Like, that is just... Yeah, yeah. Disrespectful. First of all, when I, I didn't even know that these questions were going to be this crazy. So you think my teeth are buff? No. Why would I? Why are you coming for me? I'm, I'm not coming like, for you. Yeah, but you're looking at me a certain way like I did it. Oh! Like, I'm just answering. Alright, let's just move on because these questions are kind of wild right now. What's the next one? Oh, God. Okay. This is crazy. Is there a next one? Yeah, I'm looking for the questions. There's so many questions being asked, like, this is crazy. Okay, find, like, a nice one or something that I can actually answer without having to defend myself. I don't know. Ooh, this one is from Jody. Kristen, I wish I was your sister. I just feel like you're just such a nice person. Um, can you adopt me? <laughs> that is so cute. I'll take all the siblings I can get. I will adopt you, girl. Let's just be sissy. <laughs> We're family anyways right here, so. Nah, big facts. All right, Lisa says, Kristen, are you ever going to land that plane you're flying right now? Why does it always look like you're flying away with those butterfly lashes? Doesn't your eyes need a break from all that weight? Who asks that? Lisa. What? Oh! Listen, if you don't like big lashes, <laughs> that's okay, but I like Bro, them. Butterfly? Yeah, that's what? butterfly lashes. Butter though? and she's flying. What flight? What flight is she taking? Flight? Yeah, like where? Where am I flying I'm to? I'm not gonna lie. Are these these ones are a little pretty long today? Are those the normal ones? Yeah, yeah these are Miami lashes. Those are Miami, these are Miami lashes. These are so the ones I always wear. I've never actually taken a look at your eyes. I'm really looking right now. They are. They're past your. They're past your head. What? Oh, they like, come out here. What do you mean past my head? Why they come out here? Why are they that long? Are you serious? Like, you know how my eyes are, they're in line with my head? Yeah, because you barely have any eyelashes, babe. So why are they coming all the way over here and touching your eyebrow when you blink? <laughs> okay. Anyone who knows lashes, I feel like I don't have to explain lashes to you, but some people like their lashes long, some like them shorter, mm -hmm. medium length. It all depends on what your preference is. Today, I just feel like wearing long ones. I have short ones too. But I like to wear my Miami lashes. Uh, from Lily Lashes, that's the brand, and I'm happy with the way that they look. But keep your rude comments to yourself. Like I'm trying to yeah. hear what. When are you landing your plane? Like that's not gonna make me want to answer your question. <laughs> the next rude question, I'm not answering. Okay. Kristen, it seems like as the days go by, your hairline is receding and your forehead is getting more pronounced. What are you going? When are you gonna get your curls back? What do you plan on doing about your thin hair? Next. I'm not like. Why would I answer that? I just. You don't think that's rude? Yeah, no, I think I thought I, the hair receding part. Is so is my hair receding? No, but they're probably saying it right. looks like it's receding. But how? Um, well, because your forehead's here, and then your line starts back here. What? Oh. Yeah, your my forehead's here. here. My hair line's here. here. Here, forehead here, forehead here, hair line here. It's forehead here. Here and I hear, and they're, I think they're probably asking, is it because your hair is thin and why it's moving backwards? But they don't, they don't see you on a day to day, day to day to know that that's your normal hairline. What? I'm saying they I'm don't confused. see you on a day to day basis to know that that's your regular hairline. Okay. Your hair is not receding. They're just true. You just said that it was. You said that my forehead is like far away from my hairline. I said maybe that's why they think so because your forehead is here and your hairline is here. Like any regular person though. I'm not, asking I'm not answering that. That is so insulting right now. And then you want to talk about thin hair? What are these questions? Who would ask me these questions? Is it just the same person? No, it's different people asking these how? questions. How? What do you mean how? It's a bunch of questions. Like they ask their questions and I answer. Yeah, but those seem like hater questions. Like this um, person so, does not oh, like me. Shoot, so what if it was haters that were asking to ask the questions and I didn't even pre that? So these questions came in and you never even like thought to read them? I'm just reading them as they came in right now. Okay. Anyways. I mean, I wouldn't talk to anybody like that. Like, if you have nothing nice to say, 
you know what they say. Just don't say it at all. Like, it, that doesn't make someone's day. It actually yeah, yeah, y'all are kind day. of being a little bit disrespectful now, to be honest. A little bit? There a has lot. to be one plane I'm landing. And then why is my hair so thin and receding like I'm balding or something? I'm not interested. All right. This one is from Jamie. Kristen, you're always shopping for clothes, so how come you still can't dress? All right, I'm done. No, seriously, I'm done with these questions. This is I mean, so dumb right now. I think you should defend yourself. I don't need though. to defend myself. Why am I defending myself? What am I defending myself for? Because you're always shopping and you can dress. It's not like you're just. So yeah, but then that's that up. That's up to the people to 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 determine if they like my style or not. Like, not everyone's gonna have the same style. I'm not gonna be here defending myself. Like, yo, yes, I could dress. If you don't like my style, you don't like my style. But like, that is so freaking rude. That's crazy. I'm about to just skip out most majority of these questions. I just don't understand where you get these questions from. Like, what do you mean? They asked the questions. I'm just screenshotting the questions and scrolling down for what they asked. This is the last question that I'm asking because it seems like I thought this was going to be something different and you guys is going crazy right now. Um, you recently mentioned you have psoriasis. Okay. This one seems valid. How does it feel to have a dry ass head back? Oh! Alright, I'm done, bro. That's, are you serious right now? Okay. You can't read the question before oh, reading it out loud? Oh, I should have read it before. So, so these people wanted to ask me these questions to piss me off. Is, is what you're saying to me right now? Um, that's what I'm. Cause how are you gonna ask me? How does it feel to have a dry ass head back? No, oh, they probably have psoriasis too, so it's dry in the back. They probably. Yeah, but they, they the have question. to say dry ass head back. Well, it says dry ass scaly head back. Okay. I'm done. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna answer any more of these questions. Like. Let me just find these other questions here. You guys are tripping, bro. I didn't even read the questions before. I'm sorry. That's on me. I should. I it's take. Not I take you. accountability not for you. not reading. And the I questions apologize before. for taking my anger out on you, but it's not on you. I'm saying I apologize I just, for. I just don't understand. Like. Okay, this one's a good one, Kristen. After seven years, you're finally engaged. How does it feel to be a soon-to-be wife? Feels great. I love it. Why are you answering it like that? So dry. I don't know. I'm not in the mood anymore. Like there was like twenty thousand rude questions, and now we're getting into the nice ones. Well, there was nice ones before. People were asking, saying that you, you're pretty, all that. Okay. Okay. You ready for the next one? Yeah. Kristen, I've been watching you for some time now. It's been two years and I can see that your teeth are getting yellower by the day. Do you plan on using- No, I'm fine, I'm fine. I'm not answering that question, that dumbass question. How am I teeth yellow? Like, come on, man, that's freaking rude. You're gonna sit behind the, the screen like an internet warrior and ask these questions? Well, they're asking no, me if you plan on using crushed crush white strips. Y'all disrespectful as hell. Um, most likely not gonna be posting this video because I didn't expect it to turn out like this. You guys pissed off my fiance, and, and I don't take that lightly. You know what I'm saying? If you guys are asking questions, you guys need to be asking questions the right way. You know what I'm saying? Ask good questions. Like, what are you guys asking right now? Like, are you guys serious? Turn this shit off. <sighs> Babe. Kristen, come here. Yeah. Don't worry, we're not gonna post it. I turned off the camera. Oh, I'm sorry. Sit down. What are you sorry about? There's nothing for you to be sorry about. I know, but like, now that I think about it, and I'm sitting here. I kind of agree with some of the stuff that they were saying, and I feel like you probably yeah. Maybe you don't. Maybe you don't like my eyelashes. Well, the eyebrows are a bit bushy. The teeth are big. Are you serious right now? I'm just saying. 
And I'm saying... So are might, these your questions? No, they're not So are questions. these your questions? I'm saying you might do want to get the BBL or something. All right. Okay. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. no. <laughs> Jesus, I'm praying. I'm praying. I'm praying. Don't hurt me. I need a BBL? No. It's just a joke. <laughs> 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 it's just a... <laughs> Yo. No. Yo, chill, chill. That's chill. not funny. I was just trying to be rude. I was asking you rude, really disrespectful questions. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> it's still off. <laughs> Look at you, so how do you feel? Hmm? <laughs> this is what you really want to ask me right now? Did you? So you wrote those down. And I wrote them all. <laughs> You're a savage. You're bored. Like, you're really bored. I was bored. I was bored. <laughs> <laughs> you were bored by yourself. Y'all yeah, hit that like button right now. Jeez, bitch. <laughs> Put a rush on you. Hope I ain't put it too much on you. Way more than a crush on you. And you love it when I touch on you. Yeah, I feel why you take time.